Chris 6 News at noon continues. Hey, welcome back. You know, with the arrival of spring comes the warmer weather, and after that, ah, the South Texas heat. So is your AC ready to handle the load? Well, the Better Business Bureau's Jason Meza says now's the time to find out. Yeah, best way to deal with the problem with AC is to prevent it from ever happening, right? I guess that's right. That's that would help, way, wouldn't yeah. it? Uh, you typically, AC repair HVAC uh, contractors uh, see the most complaints throughout the BBB throughout the year. Really? Yeah, over 6,000 average, and the average loss or median loss about $1,200. So it's definitely something to consider if you haven't already done so. And if you don't have a trusted uh, AC repair guy, now's the time to look for them, right? Yeah, I mean, I would imagine there are a lot of people that are doing business, uh, you know, as plumbers, as uh, HVAC, that kind mm -hmm. of thing. And they're not all on the up and up, like most of the businesses that we talk about here. Correct. There are some that are out there trying to pull off some shady stuff. Right. You were talking earlier about uh, ways to, to kind of make sure that you're dealing with some legitimate folks. So let's Correct. go through those. The okay. first one that you've got here, you say always start by doing your research. Yeah, doing some homework. If you don't have that trusted person, ask for referrals, friends or family. That's what social media is about. You have that referral network. But if you don't, you can always start at BBB.org. We do have a list trusted. Some are credited, but you can also see uh, the reviews, the complaints, kind of gauge and get some good estimates from other contracts. Okay. You also say that it's important to verify licenses. I'm, I'm imagining we're not talking about driver's licenses no, here, right? No. Something uh, more than that. You want to do this. Texas Department of License Regulation, TDLR, is the agency that regulates them. Now, you want to make sure the name and the contracting number, the license number they're using, matches up uh, before you do business with them, for sure. Okay. Now, if somebody shows up with some high-pressure tactics, that ought to throw up a red flag, right? If, if it doesn't raise your ears, it should, because mm -hmm. a great deal today, sign on the dotted line today, get that contract going, That'll a good, trustworthy company will let you will honor that the next day. So don't feel pressured to get into a contract yeah. right away before you've done some research, yeah. getting three estimates. They say, hey, sign or I'm walking away. Right. Let them walk. Let them walk. Okay. And then the last thing here, you say always, 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 just get everything in writing. Yeah, it's, it's, we've come to a day and age where we need to have the contracts, usually warranties. You want to make sure that's in writing. And those door-to-door -door solicitors, you want to be extra careful because they're not always signing things. They want a deposit up front and they mm -hmm. run away. So it's really increasingly important to get that contract. Okay. If I want a little extra help, if, I'm, if I go through all these and I'm just still not sure about the person that's either on the phone mm -hmm. or who has, as is the case sometimes, shown up at my door, where can I go to find maybe more resources? Sure. BBB.org. That's BBB.org. Mm -hmm. We can start there with the, we have the request to quote program, which allows you to search and to actually request that quote directly from an accredited business member of ours. Okay. That's got to come in handy for oh, a lot of folks, does, I yeah. would imagine. Especially all right. Now. Well, there you heard it. And of course, as always, we have put all of this, what he said, and a whole lot more on our website. You go to ChrisTV.com and you can read everything we've just gone through and you'll find the link that he just mentioned as well. So uh, hopefully, you don't feel the heat when it comes to getting your AC repaired. There Thanks you so much, Jason. Don't get burned. There All right, go. appreciate it.